What's up my crazy squirrel, this is Joking John 74 and today I want to give you guys my first impressions on the Star Wars Battlefront beta. So if you guys have not known yet, you can download this game on the PS4, Xbox One and on PC. And by the way, it's for free. You don't have to pre-order the game or anything like Black Ops 3 over there. You can actually just download it right now and uh, play the game. So um, after 30 minutes of download, one of the first main things that I pretty much noticed were the graphics they are very impressive and i know most of you guys are going to be saying like oh you just play on pc because it's 4k blah blah look i'm play i played on playstation all my years and um you know changing over to pc is just not my thing because you get a waste like over two thousand dollars and i'm not going to do that so um anyways going back into this main topic um battlefront has impressive graphics and i think they're better than the ones in black and in battlefield 4 and also in call of duty i've never seen anything like this and every time you shoot at somebody there's sparks flying i was like what they should do this more often with other games because god damn you know this is this is something i haven't seen before and that's why i was super impressed and also the explosions they are very convincing i was like damn you know that's some good stuff so uh good job by dice you know why didn't you do this on battlefield 4 because battlefield 4 you know everybody plays it hardcore gamers casual gamers uh players is just like just want a game or something like i don't know but battlefield 4 has more popularity than this game for i'm pretty sure of it so um dice should have done something with battlefield 4 but yet again, you know, Battlefield 4 was rushed out the door on, on release day and it was a buggy mess. So anyways, uh, going back into Battlefront, um, another thing that I noticed about this game was the weapons. Uh, this is a big talk and hopefully you don't dislike me for this, but um, it is a huge letdown. The weapons are a huge letdown. I know I like the, the way it sounds like pew, 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 you know, that little sound effect. But um, you cannot customize your weapons. I was like... You know, I was looking like, um, where can I like search for new scopes and new foregrips and stuff so I can make it more accurate and stuff. And there wasn't any. I was like, this can't be the full thing, is it? I know it's the beta and all, but they can't do this. They cannot just give us weapons and like, here it is. That's that's it. Go for, have fun. Like, no, they can't do this, man. So, as far as I know, on the beta of Battlefront, there is no attachment, so you cannot customize your weapon to your own liking. And that's something that Battlefield, Battlefield 4 has and Call of Duty, you know, it's on every single FPS game except on some few other ones that pretty much give you preset weapons. But um, this one, they just unlock weapons and that's it. So, in reality, there's no reason to unlock weapons. You can either use the one that has the highest rapid fire or the highest damage with slow rapid fire. So. That's that's it. You only have two weapons that you're gonna use the whole damn game. So um, another thing I want to talk about too is the accuracy in this game. God damn, you can take out somebody from across the goddamn battlefield with no problem. Uh, just imagine a football stadium, and then uh, one enemy is sitting on the other in the opposite side. You're sitting on the other opposite side, and um, if you were like to hit fire from the other side, you know and you should be, you'll be able to kill the enemy on the other side. So. That's how accurate you are in this goddamn game. I was like, oh shit, no, this is gonna be pretty much pleasing every single gamer out there, especially the casuals. The casuals, you know, the people that don't even play FPS games, they're gonna be like right, you know, good like right out the bat. So, um, so if you like, if you were to take like somebody who doesn't play FPS games, they're just gonna pretty much kill you all the time with no skill. So, yeah, um, I think that's a bad idea. But then again, you know, it is Star Wars. They're trying to please everybody, especially on Christmas. So um, once it releases in November, you know, kids who want to play Star Wars or they want to be part of the story. And, uh, you know, they're like, oh, you know, give me a game, whatever, mommy, whatever. They're going to talk to the parents and um, pretty much going to buy the game. They're going to be playing the game and they're going to be like, oh, yeah, I like it because you can just aim and just kill people. So, um, yeah, that's Star Wars for you guys. If it was Call of Duty, of course, those kids would have quit like right away and shit and they're not even going to bother coming back. So, um, so yeah, there were like some few, few letdowns in this game, which were the weapons, uh, the customization options, um, also the accuracy in the game is just, you just can't do this, man. <laughs> you just really can't. So that's why I, I say like it's, it can't be competitive because anybody can compete. So, um. So yeah, uh, the maps, it looks well done. Like I said, the graphics are, are good. Uh, the sound effects are great. Uh, the explosions are amazing, the special effects. And also, I like how there's a battle in the sky going along the way too. So it makes like the map kind of dynamic at the same time. So that's something cool to have in, in the game. Not like Call of Duty over there that shakes your fucking camera and that's it. Like, really? That's it? So um, anyways, 
that's the end of the video guys hopefully you guys enjoyed my first impression uh i know some of the things were, i said were negative but you gotta understand i'm criticizing the game because you know i know about fps games and they sh cannot be like this so um later on i'll be playing the other game mode there's only two game modes in the in the beta by the way which is a big no they should have added more um i'll be playing it and i'll be showing it to you guys here later so that is it if you guys want to see more stuff make sure you subscribe for more